Hey YouTube, today I'm gonna install a CSA, the Check Small Arms VZ58 AR Mag Adapter. This is, of course, for the 223 uh, rifle. Now, originally, the rifle comes with these mags, a uh, third round capacity, but they're unfortunately pinned to five rounds in Canada. Uh, they're less of commonly available than AR mags, and uh, the restriction here kind of makes them crappy. It's five rounds, but we're gonna put them in these uh, AR mags, which these happen to be Rock River Arms LAR15 pistol magazines, which can hold up to ten rounds. So this is preferred here in Canada. Uh, in the states you can have your full 30 round more commonly available uh, AR magazines so what you need to do come to this nice little instruction booklet and uh, these three spare parts uh, so this is the bolt catch the new one uh, this is what holds the actual adapter uh, locks it in into the rifle and this uh, another spring they put in uh, okay, so what you need to do is disassemble a few parts from the rifle. Uh, first here, it's this little, what they call the magazine catch safety pin. So what you do is just push it in and down. It'll pop right out. Now this is this pin here. That's what it looks like. Set that aside. We'll need it. Uh, next to come out is what they call magazine catch pin, which is this right here. So all you do is simply push it out here. It only goes one way. Now you don't want to push it all the way out because this uh, uh, 24 is the magazine catch will pop flying out because it has a spring. So what you want to do is just do it slowly. And put your hand over it here or hold it down otherwise it'll pop up so that's halfway comes out and here is a spring that holds it in we'll need that uh, later so you set that aside here then uh, depress the bolt catch down a little and pull the pin out the rest of the way set it aside again we'll need it now the bolt catch and original spring pop right out. Set them here. We won't need them. Um, we won't need them for the new installation. Okay, once this is out, and then you just re reverse the process, but with the new parts. So here's the modified bolt catch, and you use the new spring as well. Pop it in here. Then using our original uh, magazine catch pin, put it in back. Now insert our new uh, magazine catch, which will actually hold the magwell. Once you put it in, this will just uh, hold it uh, right here. Just like that. Put the that spring in as well, and there's a little dent, indent here on this uh, magwell catch. Make sure the spring goes in the center of that, and align it with this hole, and push our magazine catch pin fully in. Now, the magazine catch safety pin goes right back in and now we can actually insert the the magwell so it just snaps right in and that's it now holds our AR magazine and to release it it's just like an AR press this down and mag falls free 
And there you go. Couldn't be any simpler than that. Hope you enjoyed.